to get it, bro. I swear to God, I'll get it, bro. Hey, I ain't never giving up. Said, I never give up. Well, I got this, man, I got it. I will rock when I'm on it. Never rock it. Got the block when I'm toxic. Spitting logic. Make them lost it. Honest. Then I sucked it. Never caught it. Drop it. I'm the hottest. Knock, knock, bitch. Watch it. I'm the fucking king of rock, bitch. Pop it. Spitting hot shit. I'm topping. Chronic. to get it, bro. I swear to God, I'll get it, bro. Hey, I ain't never giving up. Said, I never did fall. Fake it till I make it. Motherfucker, take it. Take it back from these haters. Playing tracks for the traitors. Got the passion and depth when it happens. Factions take actions. Trapped in their captains. It's happening. I'm raising my status. Facing the madness. I'm out standing traction. Avoid the distractions. I'm snapping. No captions. Attracting mm -hmm. reactions. Adapting. Yeah, I'm ready. I'm ready when you are. <laughs> Looking good. Okay, we are live now. Uh, good evening, guys. Alina Yoni, Flan, Julie, and I are here tonight to help you with English. Julie, you cannot see the. You have the. Um, YouTube screen open there? No, right? You don't. Me? No, yeah, I don't. No, no. Unfortunately, not. I don't think my internet will uh, will agree with that. Unfortunately, so you'll have to read me what's going on. <laughs> it's not a problem. Okay. Um. Apenas uma gordinha. Just, just a a chubby woman. That's her nickname. <laughs> <laughs> That's awesome. So nice. Yeah. Bianca Bahia. Hey guys, how you doing? No, you're not late. Um, you're starting just now, actually. Yeah, getting some messages right now. So how are you guys? Lucia Macedo. So we have uh, some people here. More people are going to join us here tonight. Uh, right now, Julia, we have seven people. We have some people on uh, 
Facebook too. Fantastic. Max Goody. Hey guys, how you doing? Yeah, because people just join us late, very late. I don't know why. Mm -hmm. Seriously. <laughs> Let me just turn this off. Yeah, no, it's good. Um, so we have Paulo. Hi guys. Hey Paul, how you doing? Hi everyone. Let's not forget that uh you guys can participate with us here tonight. You can call us. Uh, Julia cannot see the number there, but the number is right on the screen right now. So they can see the number and they can call us. Um, you're supposed to cover some uh, phrasal verbs here tonight. Just a few, because uh, the main focus is just to um, help people here. Okay, so they can participate and uh, talk to us. So that's going to be something new. Have you ever done something like this, Julia? Never. I am not technologically inclined enough to figure all of this out like you are <laughs> now you're not come on you just you just saw what happened okay it's not hey hey i mean you, you got it working though I, that's some more than i could say <laughs> <laughs> yeah so right now we have um 11 people watching so more people are going to join us i'm sure we're going to have more than 20 people tonight here uh which is nice <laughs> fantastic um, that's great yeah did you know that um now uh i have hit like one, 10k on youtube you know that do you congratulations yeah, that's 10, awesome 10k it honestly it didn't change anything but yeah you know you just... <laughs> it's nice to see you deserve yeah, it and it is no it is really cool and it's yeah. really really cool seeing that there you know that 10k there awesome. um yeah all right um Guys, let's get some uh, phrasal verbs here really quick, and then you can call us and uh, participate. You can talk to Julia, because I know you guys are gonna are gonna be calling not to talk to me. You're gonna be calling to talk to her, all right? Because yeah, yeah, they see me every Monday, so you're tired of my face. It's just <laughs> but they keep be coming calling. back. They can't be that tired, right? Oh uh, yeah, no, they're just here because of you. <laughs> I advertise that a lot. I mean. You know, Fair enough. So, uh, which ones, <laughs> which ones you you got, Julia? We're gonna do this pretty much as a conversation, okay? Like we did okay. before, but just in the, like you know, an informal conversation, and then uh, they can create some sentences there, and then I'm gonna ask them to call us and uh, participate, okay? And you can ask mm -hmm. them questions later too, okay? Mm -hmm. um, Fantastic. Nice. All right. So, which ones you you got there? Give me one. I can tell you now. Oh, yeah, it sure. It was a secret before. Okay. No, yeah, no, it was uh, a my... secret. Yeah, I, I, I was not supposed to know. Mm. All right. The first one that I uh, picked was come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Yeah, come that, on. I, I told you to get an easy one, and you, you definitely got a very easy one. <laughs> well, I, yeah, it's easy, but I think it has, it has a lot of meanings, right? We can use mm -hmm. it in many different ways, and it all depends on the mm -hmm. tone yes, that no you doubt. use with it. No doubt. Right. And what is the right pronunciation of that? Depends how you're using it. So oh. if I if I'm getting really sick and tired of you, I can say, "Come on." Come on. Come on. <laughs> I think it's a phrase you use a lot. I can hear it in your voice in my head. So I think oh, it's yeah. a, one of your favorite ones maybe. <laughs> to tell to me. <laughs> yeah, maybe when you I don't know when you told me something and I was like, "Oh, come on, Julia. Come on." Yeah, exactly. Yeah, exactly. yeah, I, I do it. I do it. <laughs> maybe but maybe more often than I than I can imagine. Yeah. I do that one. I do I I I use it with Steve a lot, you know, when he's just pulling my leg or when he's a uh, he's being a baby, I say, "Come on." <laughs> yeah, that's a nice um expression there when he's pulling your leg. What does that mean? When he is uh he's joking around, right? If he's joking around, he's pulling my leg. Or sometimes when it's he's being telling silly. me something that is that's not the truth yeah nice. exactly you know where that yeah. come from, comes from that would be interesting to know like pulling your leg why pulling that leg. one i don't know how to yeah. look into it crazy right yeah 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 uh come on come on guys let's learn that's what bruno said there perfect so it can be also another way to invite someone to do something right come on so it can be very positive or it can be a little more negative depending exactly. on the context exactly mm -hmm. exactly i agree 
come on, let's do this. When you're trying to convince someone like he just did. Or when mm-hmm. you don't believe it, right? You don't believe someone. It's like, oh, come on. You did this? Yeah. That's the one I'm always using at the end. Mm-hmm. Exactly. <laughs> exactly. Okay. Uh, one that I got here um, is um, fall. Oh, no. Th- I'm going to get this later. I have a question here. Um, clean up. That's one that you just used. Uh, and uh, interesting because uh, non native speakers, let's talk about Brazilians here. We would probably just use the word clean. Do you see mm-hmm. any any difference there when you say because I know that native speakers would just say clean up and now I say clean up too, but uh, would you, you do? You, is there any difference if I say I'm going to clean my room or I'm going to clean up my room? In your understanding, later I'll I'll, I'll tell you what I think. I if we're if you're using it with an object, I uh, don't think there's much of a difference. But I do, I suppose when I think of clean, I think of like to wash. Like if I'm going to clean my room, maybe I'm going to put everything away. I'm going to vacuum the floor. I'm Mm -hmm. going to wash the windows. But if I'm going to clean up my room, I'm only talking about taking items and putting them where they're supposed to be. I don't know if that's really (laughs) it, but that's one of, that's how I would use it personally. Like, or if I'm going to clean the kitchen. Mm-hmm. That that means I'm going to scrub. But if I'm going to clean up the kitchen, I'm just putting things away. I'm not necessarily doing that scrubbing stuff. So maybe that's my personal usage. That's um, that's interesting because I've always um thought that um like when you said clean up or when you people there use clean up was more uh comprehensive with something, you know, it was like the opposite of what you just said. Maybe it is just uh, something um personal, right? Cuz uh some people are just, um, I don't know, they just exaggerate a little bit and they go like, and they say, I'm going to clean up my bedroom. And, it's, and they really clean the whole thing up, you know, mm-hmm. maybe you're, mm-hmm. maybe that's not, I don't know what you would do. I don't know. But yeah, I, it I could, could be personal. It could be understood like that too, right? Right, right. Absolutely. And I think that I think that the meanings are so similar. Mm -hmm. It's one of those phrasal verbs, which we have a few of that the meaning of the verb itself and the phrasal verb are so close that people kind of use them how they want and they use what's more common. Typically, people will use the phrasal verb over the verb, even if the meaning is the same. And I can't Mm -hmm. tell you why, because it's an extra word. I'm not sure why we do that, but we do. (laughs) And uh, but Normally, you use clean up, right? Normally, yeah, I, yeah, again, unless like unless I'm talking about scrubbing something, like if I'm gonna say I'm going to clean my shower, I would not say clean up my shower. Yeah, that would. That yeah, that would sound sounds weird. weird. Yeah, that would right? sound weird. Clean but up if we're shower, cleaning, that, I don't know. I yeah, don't know you'd say that. Right. It's interesting, so, but it would say clean up. Okay, but it makes it clean up your closet. Right, because you're right. putting things away. Yeah. Mm-hmm. It's like this putting away, which is another and great phrase. And I would not say verb. clean my closet because that would sound very weird to me. Right. Would it sound right. weird to you? It sounds very. Uh, no, I have this thing here in the back of my. It would sound very weird. I, I imagine like someone just washing that or something. I don't know. Yeah, right. Clean, like cleaning, like to wash. Yeah. See? Yeah. You do agree with me. Yeah. I imagine that. I mean, you know, um, mm-hmm. again, I, I think it depends on the context, right? The thing we're, we're talking about. Mm-hmm. Right. Exactly. Yeah. Exactly. And uh, actually, we're already kind of on one of my other phrasal verbs. I don't know okay, if we should ahead. just go to it now. Nah, go ahead, it was go actually ahead. clean out. Clean out. It was one of them. Clean out, which is specific to clean out my closet. But we sometimes have a idiom called cleaning out my closet. Oh, have yeah. you heard that one before? Yes. Right? Yes. Mm-hmm. Perfect. So it depends. It could be literally to clean out your closet, take everything out, go through it, which is what I did this weekend. I cleaned out my closet, donated a bunch of clothes. It felt great. Yes. Uh, Actually, that's the expression I hear. Um, mm-hmm. And that's uh, there is even a song, uh, Eminem, I guess. Right. Yep, yep. Up, I'm yep. Cleaning up. I'm cleaning out my closet. Something like that. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Exactly. Um, is she a teacher? Yeah, she is. <laughs> It's the pink hair. It's throwing him for a loop. <laughs> <laughs> nice. And now, what about the um, expression "fall apart"? Mm. Many meanings with that one. Yeah, 
But what first uh, comes to mind? Um, with me, I think of a physical thing, like an item. If it's falling apart, like if my computer is falling apart, it's not working very well. Maybe pieces are being removed. Yes. Right? Yes, makes perfect sense. Mm -hmm. And you can use that for people too. Do you use that about people? I about know, relationships. Yeah, about relation. I was going to say that. Yes, the relationships falling apart. Right. Mm -hmm. You can also say she is falling apart as well. So you're actually right. You're you can use it with individual people too, which means that they're very upset or they're having lots of problems. You mm -hmm. know, she's falling apart. She can't. She wasn't on time today. Yesterday, she put her pants on backwards. She's falling <laughs> apart. <laughs> nice. Nice. Yeah. Um, can you think of any other meaning? Fall apart. So relationships falling apart, not working. Items falling apart. I can't think of anything. Am I missing something? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> Not that I, I think those are the only three that I can think of. Yeah, me too. Uh, me too. Mm -hmm. That's all I, I can uh, remember right now. Right? Mm -hmm. But that's um, a really common phrasal verb. You hear it all the time. Okay. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Uh, some Definitely. people are not un understanding us. Well, I told you guys that this was going to be all in. Oh, have you learned Portuguese yet, Julia? See. Si. No, no, I haven't. I was going to try to come up with a sentence. What about Spanish? No, no I've been working on my French lately. I'm taking a French really? course right now because my French has been very bad lately. So I'm trying so, to get back to my fluent level where I was before. So you decided to learn French instead of Spanish? Well, I already knew French. I studied French oh. in university. So I wasn't ready to start a new language yet. I wanted to... To, to practice my my old language. But yes, I am planning on learning Spanish, maybe Portuguese. I really want to learn Japanese as well. Oh my They're God. all on my, my list. <laughs> yes, Spanish. Um, yeah, Portuguese is really nice. And Spanish and Portuguese are really, really close. Yeah, all right. Exactly. Okay, what is the next one you got there? Uh, next one I have is fill out. Fill out. We, we that talked about this one. one the other day, right? Why not? You picked the, you picked the same one, I believe. The other day? I haven't seen you in months. Yeah, okay. <laughs> but a long time ago. I mean, Last time we talked, it which, been... which was like, uh, I don't know, more than three months ago. Jeez. More than that. It's wow. been more than that. It's been like almost six months. It's been a while. Wow. Yeah. Yeah. Wow long time it's crazy. the the other day <laughs> <laughs> just half a year ago <laughs> <laughs> well it was last year right I, was, yeah yeah because i think year. it was before i got my new job and that would have been in october oh so my God. time oh flies God. yeah I, october <laughs> really wow this is crazy it's crazy mm -hmm. um you know you know this guy uh joe rogan the I, I do know Joe Rogan. Uh -huh. Yeah, he has this uh, podcast. Right? Mm -hmm. uh, mm -hmm. I, feel, I feel like we are in a Joe Rogan show. You know, I would <laughs> like, you know, seriously, you know, I would like to do something like that in the future, you know? Yeah, like a podcast? No, interviewing people. Ooh. Uh, I really like the idea. Not, not a, a podcast per se, but uh, just uh, mm -hmm. in interviewing people. Mm -hmm. Fuel out? No, she didn't say... No, we said fallout. No, what did what? Phil, I said Phil, F I L L, Phil. Oh, Phil, Phil. Oh no, it's not feel. Now I understand. I understand. Not feel out. Not feel, feel out is great as well. No. But yeah, but it's Phil, F I L L. Where are you from, Julia? I am from Massachusetts originally, but I travel. Now I travel around the United States and I am currently in San Diego, California. Okay. There you go, Bianca. Fill out. She's asking uh, to type the phrasal verb there. It's a hard one. That short I is really hard for Portuguese speakers. Fill. It's a very short I. Almost sounds like a all, like a U sound, but it's mm -hmm. not full out. Fill out. Yeah. Yes. 
that's a, a problem we have, right? Um, I mean, Brazilians, the short eye and the long eye. Mm -hmm. Yeah, she's uh, from Absolutely. the United States, Flam. Flam Jos, Jess Winter. That's a nice name there. Time flies. Mm -hmm. That's a good expression. That's what Bruno said. Yeah, Bruno. Um, are you ready to call us, Bruno? Because Bruno is going to talk to us live. Bruno, is gonna... right. Bruno, you have to be the first, man. We have there T <laughs> Diego on Facebook, Tiago. Tiago. I, I hope Tiago is there because uh, he's such a nice person, but I, I don't know where he is. And uh, depending on where he is now, his connection is not so good. He was in uh, um, Antarctica. Antarctica, is that? Ed Art. Yeah. Are you sure? No, he was. No, he was there. Yes, he was there. Wow. I so, mean, he was so talking white. to you from Antarctica. No, he was not. He was not there. I think he was uh, back to Brazil, and maybe he's back okay. there. I don't know. Oh, okay. uh, but maybe his internet there is better than my internet here. <laughs> <laughs> That'd be saying something. <laughs> yeah. So it would be nice. It would be nice to have him there, uh, just you know, talking to us. But I'm sure he would not be able to just call us. You know, maybe I don't know. Maybe, but maybe Bruno... call us on his penguin phone. <laughs> um, Bruno, Bianca, and some other people here, uh, and uh, Michelle, you guys have to call. Okay, uh, the others here because some people are shy. You know, just the other day, Julia just said you can call me and talk to me and all that, and people were just like shy and they didn't call. So I hope they don't let's say shy away today. So they don't, mm -hmm. yeah, get a, what do you call it? Get cold or, feet. Or chicken out. Or chicken out. Yeah, don't, <laughs> don't be a chicken. Just call us. <laughs> the number is there. Yeah, the number is there. If you want to call, you can call from now and then we can test that. I hope we don't have any problems. <laughs> um, we'll find out. Yeah, we'll find out. But you can call us here. Bruno, uh, Bianca, um, and Michelle. You can. The number is here. I know you can call, and I know you want to talk to us. Actually, I have never talked to Bruno, right? I don't even know who he is. Mm -hmm. Do you know? No. No, I don't know Bruno. No, okay. You see Bruno, call us. Talk to us live. I'd, uh, I'd like to get to know Bruno if yeah. he would call, but yeah. we'll see. You see Bruno. Uh, Bianca, <laughs> too. Bianca needs to practice her English. Uh, mm -hmm. She's my student, too. Um, mm -hmm. And... Michelle, she has a channel here on YouTube too, and she teaches uh, people how to, you know, it's a makeup thing, you know, it's a beauty. Oh, channel, whatever, that's awesome. Whatever you call that. Yeah. Right? That's and uh, she great. talks about um, positivity too, you know, because, um, awesome. yeah, you know, feeling good about yourself and all that. So it's, um, it's, a, it's really nice. It's really nice. But it's a, it's a small great. channel. She just, she just started. Mm -hmm. And uh, speaking Fantastic. of channels, you have That's a channel awesome. too, right? Oh, can you hear that? Somebody's calling. Oh my God. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna. There see we if go. You can hear Answer that. it. I see if it is Bruno. Hello. Hello, me, Bruno. See, told you. Can you hear? Hi, can you Bruno. hear Bruno? I can hear. Hello. How are you doing? Nice to talk to you. <laughs> nice to talk to you too. Yeah, you don't know me, but I know you. I, you're famous here in Elder Channel. <laughs> <Really? laughs> That's great. I'm glad. I'm, that makes me very happy that I get the attention on Helder's channel. That's wonderful. Thank you. <laughs> I didn't know yeah, that. Thank you for, for, for your time here with us because actually I love watching your videos when you are talking to Elder. And now this opportunity to interact with you is really good. So thank you very much. That's awesome. You're so welcome. And wh where do you live, Bruno? Sorry, uh, the, the, the audio quality here is really poor. I can't hear you. Oh, it's OK. I asked you, where do you live? Oh, where I live? Uh, mm -hmm. I live in Rio, Rio de Janeiro, the, the same city of Elder. We have never met uh, a yeah. person, but we live in the same city. Fantastic. Actually, I have never seen him <laughs> in person. I mean, uh, there you, go. you know, yeah, technology. It's just I see uh, his family. I've seen his family. I've seen uh, many pictures of this guy, but I have never seen him in person. 
Well, there yeah. you go. Well, now now you hear his voice. So when you're in the grocery store and you hear something oh, behind, he's my student. <laughs> I <know laughs> talk to him uh, every week. Actually, once a week. Uh, okay, that's great. Right, fantastic. Bro. I don't know if he can hear me. Sorry, uh, sorry, the audio is really, really bad. I can't understand you. <laughs> okay, can you hear me now? Uh, yeah, uh, now I think it's a, a bit better now. Nice, nice. That's good, man. Um, you see, Julia, he speaks English uh, very well. Actually, he helps me a lot there in um, with the WhatsApp. And uh, awesome. he, he has become a, a teacher there. Wow. <laughs> yeah. I don't know why they call me teacher because I'm not a teacher. So <laughs> <laughs> sometimes you just get pressured because oh no, I'm not a teacher, but you 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 just keep calling me a teacher. Okay, okay, so <laughs> just do that. Yeah, we have a nice saying. You can say if the shoe fits, which means if you act like a teacher and you look like a teacher, then you are a teacher. <laughs> That's all it takes. <laughs> No doubt, no yeah, doubt. Uh, yeah, I like to help people there in the group, and actually, sometimes when people ask something, I I really have research for answering them. So it's useful for me too. I can learn a lot of things there in the group while I am helping out people. So <laughs> I love the, the group, and actually, uh, English is my passion, and I still have a lot a lot to do. But with how does how <laughs> I'm gonna get there. That's awesome. So you're not a teacher, but what do you do? I work in IT, actually. I'm a programmer, a software developer. Uh, Fantastic. English is my passion. I don't use English at work, and mm -hmm. I don't talk to people in English here in Brazil at work. So uh, I, 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 I could, find some, could find some people online. So I have some friends from the United States. I have a friend from... Uh, Australia, and yeah, I'm always trying to practice with native people. That's awesome. Isn't the internet amazing? Now you can learn English at home in your pajamas <laughs> and talk to people everywhere. That's what I do. I don't know about you, but <laughs> that's awesome. So cool. Don't laugh at me. <laughs> just the other day I was going to do that, but then um, my wife just uh, lashed out at me. She was like, hey, what the heck are you you know, what the heck are you doing? I said, nobody's going to see me. <laughs> yeah, it's like, uh, it's crazy. But I don't know, I don't know why, but your, your sound is very low here to me. Um, but, Sorry? yeah, your sound is very low to me. Is it low to you too, Julia? It's like medium. I can hear him, but it's, it's a little low, but I can hear him. Yeah, it's a little bit low. Mm -hmm. um, and. Uh, Bruno, you there, uh, there in the group, you're pretty much a teacher. So you teach people there. That's what you do. You help people. So you teach them and all that. So that makes you a teacher. You don't need a, a diploma, right? To just be a teacher. Come on. A diploma doesn't make a teacher. Yeah. Yeah. yeah so following this concept that teacher is someone who helps people, who teaches people. <laughs> yeah, so there in the group, I'm a teacher. Yeah. There you go. Very nice, Bruno. Go. Very nice talking to you here. Uh, you have a good day there, man. Yeah, okay. Thank you very much for Thanks for calling, man. Nice to talk to you, Julia. Enjoy nice that. to talk to you, Bruno. Nice to meet you. Have a good night. <laughs> Thank you. You too. Bye-bye. Bye. Yeah, he's, he, he's a good person. Um, yeah, he seems like a very nice guy. Yeah. He has uh, worked really hard in his English. Um, I can tell. Yeah. It sounds great. Yeah, he has done a lot of stuff. Um, and actually, he's the teacher there in the group, not me, because he's always there helping people, and I don't have time to do anything there. So it's, it's all about Bruno there. It's like the, That's he, has, awesome. he has everybody there's just a, he's fan, you know? It's like, you know? <laughs> It's like Bruno, 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 and then go. Sometimes when I say something there, people just go like, "Who's this guy?" <laughs> you know, it's all about Bruno, Who does he Bruno, think Bruno. he is? He's not Bruno. Yeah. Only yeah. Bruno. When I help people, when I help people, people just go like, "Bruno, is he right?" It's like shit. 
<laughs> he's, giving, he's giving you a run for your money. Yeah. He's making it tough. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Uh, actually, we have uh, Bruno's sister here uh, watching us. Yes. Fantastic. It's your Bruno. It's your brother. <laughs> <laughs> Bianca, 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 call us Bianca. Bianca needs to practice. Uh, I don't know if she gets some good signal there from you know where she lives. It's a kind of uh, isolated. It's a very bad area here in, in Rio. Mm. <laughs> she hates when I say that. I'm just I'm just pulling her leg. <laughs> <laughs> actually it's it's actually it's very close from here um mm. but it is you know those areas i believe you have like areas like that in the united states too it's pretty much like uh on one side of the street you have good internet and all that blah blah cable tv but on the other side it's like it's n none of that is available mm -hmm. right mm -hmm. it's just it's just insane but it's pretty much like uh this this neighborhood where she lives in it's just a uh, one company and this company sucks uh, it's just amazing it's amazing she always has some problems but uh -huh. i mean uh internet but not to use her phone i guess mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Right. so bianca mm -hmm. you got a call and um who else i said michelle michelle needs to call too and practice her english yes i hate this delay on, on youtube my god i hate that it's like I, we can even interact with people. Um, and anybody who wants to call, and if you speak English and want to train with us, the number is here. You can call us. Let's get another uh, phrasal verb there, Julia. Sure, absolutely. Well, did we didn't talk about fill out? Oh yeah, we, we did got. Not. We were we were talking a little bit about it, but yeah, the reason that I picked fill out is again a double meaning, one easy meaning. We know, right? Like to fill out a form fill out would a mean form. to. Perfect. to complete but also if we say that somebody is filling out do you know what that means okay we have maybe bianca now oh she's ready hello hello, hello. bianca <laughs> hello Julia. hello bianca how are you fine how are you did i like you so much you are very funny <laughs> Girl, you're so beautiful. I'm happy to talk to you. Oh, oh my god, you got a I'm, fan. Oh my god. Oh, I'm so happy to talk to you, Bianca. Thank people you so much. People have never said that about me. It's just crazy, right? They they haven't said that you're a beautiful, funny girl. I can't no, I imagine mean, uh, why. <laughs> you know, just take out the the girl part. Where I live, I live in a good place. I was just said I live in a in a my there's an existence. I believe you, Bianca. I don't believe Helder. I don't believe a word he says. I believe you. Fantastic. Yeah, whatever. Whatever you say. <laughs> I live. I live next to Helder. We are almost neighbors. See? Remember what I said? Yeah, remember what I said about the street, you know, one side and then the other side? She lives on the the bad side. <laughs> you know, the dark side of the moon. Remember these uh, Transformers? It's like, yep. Yeah, she lives That's... on the dark side of the moon. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Wow. Bianca, how long have you been learning English? Yeah, how long have you been learning English? Uh, sorry, Julia, uh, your voice is breaking up. Yeah, you but, I, uh, I told you, I told you, I told you. <laughs> can can, no, but can you hear me? Mm -hmm. can, can you hear Helder better? Helder. Maybe, Helder, can you repeat my yeah, question? She, she asked uh, how long you have been uh, studying or learning English. Ah, okay. Uh, I have been studying English, I believe, for uh, eight years. Eight years, I believe. Because uh, Elder was my teacher in English course. And after that, uh, uh, and after that, 
to become my teacher, uh, my online teacher. I'm here to, to practice uh, with listening, teaching. I believe uh, I've been learning uh, eight years, I don't know. Wow, that's awesome. <laughs> Yeah, she That's talks to, awesome. to people from uh, several countries almost every day, right, Bianca? Uh, uh, because uh, uh, I intend to, to, to um, improve uh, uh, my English because mm -hmm. I, I work, uh, in my work, uh, I receive um, some, uh, some calls from Mexico and the United States, but always speaking English. So uh, I, I, after uh, my English uh, online with Elder, and I noticed I improved, uh, improved a lot. But I I can to, to become a fluent. I'm not fluent English, but I can understand many, many things with English. It's, it's very clear, Julia. You, it, it, it's very, for me, it's easy to understand you in many things. Awesome. That's great. That's you. That's because you understand English well. There you go. That's awesome. My Congratulations. God. Next time, next time I see Bianca, okay. Bianca's going to be wearing a shirt and then I'm there. I heart Julia. So it's like that. Well, you know what? I'll I'll make the same one and I'll say I heart Bianca and then you're not invited to our party. You can't come. <laughs> um Bianca, you see Julia can understand you very well. No problems there. Mhm. Mm mm -hmm. Absolutely. Yeah, your English is great. Did you understand me, Julia? Really? <laughs> really? Yes. <laughs> I don't I don't speak Portuguese. So you aren't speaking Portuguese. You must be speaking English. So you're yeah, you're doing great. People just just have this I don't know, this crazy idea, right? I, really? You understand me? Oh my god. It's like talking to uh let's see a native speaker. I mean, a, a good one, a good communicator and all that. A person who cares, you know, and all that. Uh, you know. Um it's not it's not hard. Actually, it's uh, um, easier than we think, right, Julia? It's true. It's true. If you're, yeah, like you said, if you're talking to someone who is nice and who is willing to listen to you and be patient, then they will understand everything, mostly everything you say, usually. <laughs> um, so, and, and if they don't understand you, that's okay, too. You keep trying. You keep speaking. And you, you will communicate. But no, you're doing great, Bianca. I'm having no since problems. You're, since you're uh, Julia's fan, uh, do you have any question for her? Me? Yes, Bahia. <laughs> do you have any question for Julia? <laughs> no, no, I don't have any questions. Uh, I'm only uh, uh, paying attention in, in your conversation to... to to learn more expressions, more phrasal verbs. Because I like phrasal verbs, but it's hard. Yeah. There are many meanings, so but but I like them, and I like this kind of class. And prefer I prefer only paying attention to the conversation. Yeah. Okay. Whatever. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Thank you, Bianca. Thank you very much. Thank you. Nice yeah. to meet you. Oh, <laughs> your screen just fell off. But it's fine. I, I prefer that background. To be should honest. I prefer? Should I just take it down? Yeah, it's my normal work screen. I prefer that, to be honest. It uh, my wall likes to be naked. <laughs> <laughs> just taking off its clothes. I, don't know. I have talked to some. Yeah, I have talked to some people, and they have just this background, and you know, it's pretty much like a curtain. It doesn't look mm -hmm. so nice, you know. I could have like a, a green screen here. But I don't, you know, I just leave that, you know, there. Yeah, I have to have this for my job, and I just I, had I, it up. I know. The only thing is that now you have the mirror, so you're going to see Steve no, if he walks no, by. No, no, Oh, well, you know, that's not a problem at all. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, William. How you doing, man? William Guimarães. Good to see you, man. I used to be my student, I don't know, many years ago. 
maybe back in uh, I don't know, two thousand four, five. Like, wow. That's a long time ago. And I'm getting old. It's a long time ago. We have Alan Gomez. Alan, are you watching with your wife? Because uh, so some people here just watch uh, me and now they are watching you from their TV. You know, from their smart wow. TV. And he has Very a 4K cool. TV. So that's, you know. Yeah, but it doesn't, it doesn't change much because this is uh, in HD. So I'm sorry, man. It's not in 4K. <laughs> <laughs> Then we could actually be in your living room and be like, we're there, right there with you. But I don't know if I want my face in 4K. Yeah, that would be weird. I'm, I mean, I'm not my ready face, for I'm that. Sure, I'm sure my face would be weird. Maybe yours would be okay, but mine would be very weird. You know, there, there's this guy here, and uh, he's very famous, this uh, TV host. And uh, um, all the shows on this channel are in full HD, except his show, because he didn't want people just to see, you know, the flaws. And uh, his face and all that, because he's very old. Um, crazy, right? And it's amazing because I see some shows here in full HD. It is like, it is weird because you can't see these things through naked eyes. You know, it's just it's like yeah. magnifying glass. You know, it's crazy, and it shows things that you can't see if you're just looking at a person. That that makes that weird. I remember I when I shot, yeah, I remember when I saw a show and uh, the guy was singing and I could see the saliva just, you know, this, just coming out of his mouth. And now that was like, wow, that's HD because I had never seen that before. <laughs> no, it's like when, almost that, that too gross. No, but I mean, that's hap that happens when you're talking, you know? Right, of course. But of we course. can't see it. Except, right. okay, only when some people we can, and that's, that's really disgusting. But what I'm saying is like the, the little, little, little ones that you can't see, you know, you can't see. But then uh, this full HD, I could see that. And imagine in 4K, my God, it's just crazy. That's why all oh, these people you. are, yeah, that's why all these people are whitening their teeth, uh, lots of makeup and all that, because you can see pretty much everything, all right? Yep, yep, it's true. Crazy. That's true. Um, anyway, but, uh, what is the other phrasal verb you got there? I'm going to get my list here. Just minimize Sure. <clears throat> I got a phrasal verb. It's kind of a double phrasal verb because I want to talk about think of versus think about. Oh, okay. That's and interesting. And how they're both similar. Mm -hmm. Right? So if, we're, if I ask you to think of a color, like think of a color and then you say blue i'm thinking of blue but i'm if i'm asking you what do you think about a color it's a little bit of a different question but mm -hmm. different verb right then i'm asking you your opinion perfect and now think of could also be your opinion but typically we use that more for like um uh actually no we use both like, right <laughs> we say that now that i'm thinking about it like what do you think of that tv show and what do you yeah, think about that i was gonna TV yeah show? i was we gonna say it. that they are pretty much uh yeah. they sound pretty much the same to me but certainly yeah. again um since it is all context um mm -hmm. it all depends on uh, the context and then one sounds more uh common than the other right mm -hmm. but yeah mm -hmm. definitely uh think about think about sounds a lot more common to me than uh, mm -hmm. think of Okay, Definitely. But, yeah. Definitely. So what do you think about these? Um, I would not say like, it, it doesn't sound wrong, but it is not something I would say. What do you think of that? What do you think of this movie? Uh, mm -hmm. Okay, it is not wrong, but what do you think about this movie? <clears throat> Probably. I don't know. That's what I, what okay. I hear normally. But I know the other one is not wrong. Mm -hmm. All right. mm -hmm. Hey, Klaus. Yep. Klaus is in uh, the United States, I guess. Fantastic. Uh, Hi, Klaus. Yeah. Uh, guys, we have time just for one more call. Feel free to call us here. Uh, this is the number. So you can call us and talk to Julia live because I know you don't want to talk to me. You just want to talk to her. You know? Um, you're starting a new fan club here. <laughs> <laughs> yes, where are you in, in the United States, uh, Klaus? He's talking to me from uh, Facebook. So Facebook's Fantastic. a lot slower. It's crazy. It's a lot slower than YouTube. Mm. Like the, the, the delay is just amazing. Amazing. Mm. I'm using this uh, restream. You know what that is? Yeah, I've heard of it. I don't use it though, but I've heard of it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, he's living in Florida. Mm -hmm. that's, that's quite Very fast. nice. 
We're quite fast. That's quite fast. Actually. Yeah, that was fast. Yeah. Yeah. Um, yeah, he's not going to call us because the number is a, a local number and he's in the United mm. States, so he's not going to call us. Um, mm. But that's very nice, man. And how's your English? He used to be my student too, a long time ago. <sighs> I, don't, I don't keep tabs, so I don't know when exactly, um, but maybe four or five years ago, Carlos, maybe. I, I don't know. Refresh my memory there. He said, unfortunately. Not about the call, okay? Not about being my student. Just contextualize it. <laughs> uh, <laughs> I guess. I don't know. <laughs> you never know. Um, let me see here. Uh, yeah, he said he improved a lot. Yeah, man. Good. Just tell people there that you learned uh, from me so they can become my students and I can make more cash. <laughs> <laughs> I'm joking. Where am I? Kind of. Where am I? <laughs> uh, there was this show on TV. The guy was always like, uh, I'm doing this, but uh, where am I? It wasn't, I don't remember. There was a show that the guy was always doing that, right? Maybe it was a cartoon or something. I, I think I know what you're talking It sounds familiar, but yeah. I can't put my finger on you see, it. Yeah, that's a nice expression there, by the way. I cannot put my finger on it. Uh, mm -hmm. um, what, what does that mean? means that uh, I don't quite remember, right? Yeah. It's similar to the other one we say, it's on the tip of my tongue, right? But it just means I don't quite remember. Yeah, mm -hmm. perfect. Uh, you see, I was talking to Klaus here on uh, Facebook, and he's responding and all that. And Alan, mm -hmm. who's there on uh, YouTube, has not answered yet. See, that's crazy, because uh, YouTube is just so freaking slow. We have a lot of people watching. And uh, hey, Alex, how you doing, man? Um, feel free to call us. I don't know if they, if they understand me. Some people here are just uh, beginners. You can call us, um, and the number is just a local number, uh, so some cannot call because uh, the call would be expensive. Although we have some, it's pretty much like uh, unlimited now. You know, can make unlimited calls. Mm -hmm, uh, I mm -hmm. think it is the same in the United States now, right? Yeah, because nobody yeah, calls we... anymore. No, nobody makes. Yeah, nobody makes calls anymore. It's just crazy. Because I, I, under, I understand that before it needed to be expensive because, you know, the towers, you know, very limited and all that. But now nobody's calling, you know, so it's fine. So they have like pretty much to beg so people can use that. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Um, I'm glad you have improved a lot, Klaus. <coughs> um, I'm glad. Um, yeah, I'm going to get another uh, phrasal verb. Here's watch out. Mm. Um, I, I talked about this <coughs> phrasal verb last week here i guess or maybe mm -hmm. that was the week before uh and um what first comes to a head when you just hear that watch out means yeah. like get out of the way move <laughs> right be careful danger <laughs> yes <clears throat> yes exactly like something bad is going to happen or it's about to mm -hmm. happen and you want to warn mm -hmm. the person oh come on mm -hmm. steve shaved his head no, that's not Steve. That's Steve's brother. My <laughs> they God. <can> see. <laughs> it's like, thank God, because that would look so bad. I mean, I like, I like his hair. Come on. That wouldn't be Steve. <laughs> no, they're, <laughs> they're opposite. Steve, Steve has a, the head of hair and Danny's got a, a big oh, beard. Oh, yeah. Man, mm -hmm. it's just, mm -hmm. it's just amazing. God, is so unfair sometimes, you know? No, seriously. I really wanted to have, like, you know, long and nice beard you know like oh and all that but i can't I, I i've tried but i can't it's just crazy and i tried to um, like uh kind of paint or something what is that i don't know the name of that it's gonna paint you know yeah like a hair went, dye yeah yeah i i went to a um a barber shop here and and the guy said yeah like i can apply a little bit of this here and uh nobody's gonna notice the difference i was like yeah mm -hmm. okay fine and it was mm -hmm. like a wearing, I was wearing a costume or something. You know, it was uh, crazy. It was part of a costume, you know, part of a disguise. But a very, it, it is like a disguise on a budget, mm -hmm. you know? Mm -hmm. look looked so bad. And I was so happy at first, you know? And then I, I just, yeah. And then I, I just took a shower and then it disappeared. It was crazy. It was crazy. That was very low quality ink or paint or whatever the, that thing that the guy used. But I, I felt so nice at first because it was like, wow, that's, you know, like full beard. Like, that. like uh, what is the name of that guy? 
uh, Chuck Norris. You know, I felt like yeah, Chuck, I... black Chuck Norris. And I was like, wow, that is so cool. <laughs> no, you know when you feel seriously. I'm not seriously. You know when you, I, 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 I got out of the the barber shop and I was like, yeah, you know, seriously, that that really, um, made me feel good. You know, it is like a child that was had just you know, uh, whose dream had just come true or something. And um, but uh, the other uh, there was a, a, another day, and then I I I did the same. So the guy this time he did a better job. And then I, I got home, you know, feeling all cool and all that. And my wife was just like, what did you do there? You know, why did you do that? You, can't you see that's just ink? You know, it just looks so fake. Mm -hmm. <laughs> she, to mm -hmm. she totally mm -hmm. burst my bubble. I was so happy. Seriously, I was really happy. And she just, mm -hmm. God, man, it's just amazing. Uh, anyway, do you have another one there? I have one. I have look over. Oh, that's interesting. Look over, right? So you could look over a document, which would mean to review something, right? I'll look it over. Um, I'll yeah. review it. Or yeah. it could you could look literally look over. Like if someone is in front of you, look over their shoulder. Mm -hmm. it would mean to to look at them and to watch them. Perfect. Perfect. Yeah. Um, normally when I see uh, these or here and these there, it's um, about uh, reviewing, maybe because of um, the environment, you know, the teaching environment. Uh, so look over something that you've done, you know, your homework or the lesson or something. But yeah, look over somebody's shoulder. I believe that's even a song. Um, mm -hmm. I'm going to get just uh, one more here. And, uh, get okay. off. What, it's a good one. This this means a lot of things, but um, uh, mm. what what first do you think of when you hear that? Get off. I think for me, like if I'm trying to get something off of it, right? Get off would be to remove something from your clothes. Maybe like get the sauce off my shirt, <laughs> get that bug off my shoulder. I don't know. I guess that's one thought. Mm -hmm. There was one. Uh, isn't it? Um, get off my face or something like that get off get that would be get out of get my out, face get out of my face okay get okay. off my back get off my yeah perfect perfect get mm -hmm. off my back mm -hmm. get out of my face like that mm -hmm. yeah exactly um also what um i talked about this here too is like uh get off when you talk about a means of uh, transportation too mm -hmm. um right get off a bus mm -hmm. you get off a train and all that Right. Mm -hmm. Exactly. Um, exactly. Also get, um, you would say that too, although I probably would use the word take, but get your hands off me. Perfect. Right? Mm -hmm. yeah. You remember how many times you heard that? Actually, actually you said that to guys. <laughs> yeah. in the past get your you hands off when I was single. Yeah. Uh, yeah a few times. Definitely. <laughs> My usually it was not so nice. Get something off of me is a little bit nicer than what I would say. <laughs> oh, yes. yeah. You would uh, spice it up a little bit. Yeah, a little spicier. <laughs> yes, yes. My God, speaking of uh, spicing things up, I just remember just the final thing here. Um, Spice Girls. They are having this tour out there, and then uh, I don't know where. I think it's in the UK or something. I don't know. And then uh, I don't know why they did that. The the black one, Mel C, just said that she had a relationship, quick relationship there, with the 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 other one that's uh, red haired. I I don't know the name. Really, Ginger yeah. Spice. Yeah, yeah. I think they, they had a relationship. Yeah, it's like well, they the the they had sex. That's what she said. Well. Well, I think that the the Ginger Spice was was a porn porn star before she was a Spice Girl. Really? So, mm hmm. My God, I didn't know that. Crazy. Yeah. So maybe it was something related to that. Yeah, pretty maybe. much like uh, Cardi B, right? I mean, Cardi B was not a porn star; she was a stripper. Right. Mm hmm. Exactly. Wow. I was list. Have you ever listened to her first uh, the her latest single? I'm not uh, sure if please, I have. Please, please me, please something, please. No, I haven't. I'll have to listen to it. My I like God. her stuff. You like no. her? You like her? 
I think uh, she's good. Really? <laughs> <laughs> what, because not... she's not good or because you're surprised that I like her? <laughs> I'm surprised that she'll like her. Um, but it, it's because, uh, I don't know, I can't imagine you singing her lyrics. It's just, it is just weird, you know? I, I can't imagine myself singing that. I don't know, it's just, just too much. And it's like, I don't know. It's like if, if she tried to sing the, uh, her song, let's say her latest song on TV, it would be pretty much like, I don't know, 92% bleep or beep, right? It's a beep. Like, yeah. La, 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 bleep. Yeah, bleep. Yeah. beep, 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 beep. So all the time she talks about this and that, her part, body parts and blah, blah, blah. And you have to do this to me, my body parts, blah, blah, blah. And, and that's pretty much the colors, blah, 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 body parts, you know? <laughs> So I can't Guys have been you... doing it for years. Why can't women do it now? No, I love uh, it. Oh, come on, but it is not. I'm not saying that just because uh, she's a woman. I, I can't imagine myself singing 50 Cent either. Yeah. <laughs> or, or what is the name of that guy? Um, the one that smokes grass. What is his name? A lot. Snoopy Dog. You know. Snoop Dog. <laughs> yeah. I can't, I, can't, I can't. I hate the way he talks. It's just weird. You know. It's like he's always on drugs. Because he's always I mean, in he, drugs. He is. <laughs> <laughs> what are you ex What are you expecting? That's what you get with Snoop Dogg. But uh, no, I like I like rap music. I mean, I I like that stuff. But uh, it's not the only thing. I just I appreciate all music, and I appreciate the profanities oh as well. God. It has its place. I wouldn't sing it in front of my mother, but you know, in the shower by yourself, it can be fun. Why not? My God, no, I can't. I can't imagine that. But yeah, no, I'm. Sh I, I mean, I like the song. But, you know, I still feel uncomfortable when she sings some parts of that song. And I can't imagine this woman singing that on, on TV. Just crazy. But um, Maybe that's the point. Uh, Maybe that's the point. Make you uncomfortable. But, uh, maybe. Maybe. I don't know. Um, I'd like to have a conversation uh, on, on that. Maybe we can meet and, and talk about it. Uh, there, there are some <laughs> points that I would like to make that I cannot you know, just say it here. Um, but again, <laughs> um, we have to go. Uh, thanks a lot, uh, Julia, for being here tonight. Thanks a lot, guys, for watching. We had uh, uh, some, some people here on uh, YouTube and some people on Facebook too, which is nice. But people are always having some problems there. They always get disconnected and then they return. But um, Klaus, William, Tiago, Diego, and uh, Danilo Adelange. Adelange is Bruno's sister. Mm. Uh, Michelle, Alan. Bianca is saying thanks, Julia. You see? My God. You see the difference? Bruno just go like, thank you, Julia and Elder. And then Bianca just, thanks, Julia. See Girl that? power. We got to yeah. stick together. <laughs> <laughs> um, Alex. Uh, who else was here? I know that there are a lot of people, but they don't see anything in, in chat. It's very hard to use the YouTube chat using your mobile. It's crazy. Did you know that? It's very hard. Uh, good night, everyone. Yeah, good night. Uh, thanks a lot, guys, for watching. Julia, once more, thank you. Uh, we're going to talk again later. <laughs> but Sounds thanks good. a lot. Thank you. And thank you, and thanks to everyone here. Yeah, we're gonna need, we, yeah, we're going to do this again later in the future. And then I'll get this, this call thing to work here. Because that is just, yeah, Bianca's just laughing now because I said that. You mean like, <laughs> like two, two hours later because of uh, YouTube's delay. But, you know, it's, oh. it's crazy that, you know, it, wouldn't, it would never work if I, uh, like, doing comedy here. You know, it's comedy's no. time, you know? Yeah. So YouTube was just F me. Uh, Nadia, hey, Na you see, she was there and she, she said nothing. Hey, Nadia. Goodbye. <laughs> yes, please. Bruno said yes, please. We need to do this again. Um, all right. Thank you. And you guys have a good night. And uh, good night, Julia. Bye. Thank I'm gonna, you. I'm going to hang up here too. Okay, Julia. Sounds good. All right. Bye. Bye. -bye.